Hello friends, uh, welcome again and uh, this is my project laboratory management system and I have developed this project in PHP and MySQL. The version for the PHP I am using is the PHP version 7 and the MySQL version is 5.6 and uh, uh, I am running this project on the Jam server but if you have the web server or other PHP application means application servers then you can run this project on that server also right and if you are using the mac operating system then you can run this project on the map server for linux operating system you can use the lamp server right so these all are the technology stack uh, which i am using as a, for the back end right for front end development i am using the html css and javascript some of the jquery library i also have used like uh, form validations creating uh, data tables and the uh, integration of the date plugins right and many of the jquery plugins i have used for developing this project right so these all technologies i have used for developing it right so let's start with the functionality go through so the project title is laboratory management system and it's a php and mysql major project right it has only and only admin login but the customer means the patient can search their report and see their reports also and print that report also right so let's start so this is the home page of the page so you can see this is a simple store home page right and if you want to change the content then you can change the content from here right from index.html page index.php page this is the about us project right this is about a about uh, the project right if you want to change it if you want to add the name then you can do it directly from the about us php this is a search report from where you will be able to search the report right so if you have given the test then you can search the report from your mobile number here right so like if you enter a mobile number then if any report uh, exists in the system with that mobile number then you will be able to search it using the mobile number right so you can see this is the details of the patient and patient can see the receipts as well as the results right once you click on the view receipts you can see that this is the receipts and you can print it also right even sorry uh, let me refresh it right if you can click on the view result then you will be able to see the results right what is the results and these all things you can see right so you can create this also miss admin can create this results uh, from the backend panel right so this is the search report right you will enter the mobile number and after that you will be able to search the things this is the login from where admin will be able to log in and he can perform various type of operations right <clears throat> this is a contact us page this is a static contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page so you can treat it as a uh, static contact form this is a login so the user id is, is admin and the password is test so once you log inside the system this is the admin dashboard so admin can perform this much of operations right so we have created we have developed all of these forms all of the links are working and there is no error in the links right there is no error in the forms right so let me go through one by one home already explained you about us already explained you search report already i have explained you you can search your report <laughs> this is a dashboard from where admin can see the all of the menu options right so these menus are also available here also here right so you can see these are the menu options you can see these are the menu options also so these all menus are available here right so let me go through one by one this is a add patient from where admin will be able to add all of the information of the patient right all of the information of the patients right this is the add test so from here so on the uh, means admin can add any number of states and after that those tests will be available at the time of billing this is the test type means what type of test type it's a urine test or blood test <coughs> so you can add those test types from here this is the add patient test right this is the main important form and which connects these three all right so here it's asking for the patient right select patient so you can select the patient from here right so you can select anyone like uh, this one or this one right so once you click on the continue to billing then you will get this form right from where you will be able to select the uh, items right so select the test so cbc i want to select and once you click on that then you can see the cbc test has been added right 
so once you click on the diabetes test then you can see diabetes test has been added and cost are calculating automatically when you click on the vitamins then you can see vitamins test and added and this is the cost right so if you click on the kidney profile then kidney test has been added right so this is the 450 rupees so all of the test has been added but if you want to remove it just click on the minus button and those test will be removed from this here this bring items and even that you can add the test later also right so total amount the customer needs to pay is 1660 rupees so this is the first time if customer is coming and customer asked for the test right then what you you will do you will uh, uh, create the bill for the customer so this is this is the mm, that part right so once you click on the save and print then this all information will be saved into the database and after that you can add the report of those tests right so i have added there are uh, this four tests right diabetes vitamin kidney and the wbc right for the rita devi for bill number four once you click on the save and print you will be able to uh, get this printable format and just click on the print for print this item right so this is the add patient test right i already explained you now this so now i'm going on the reports part so let me go through one by one so this is the this i will uh, explain you later so this is the test report so all of the test which you have added will be displayed here you can edit it right even you can delete the information from here also right this is the patient report all of the patient which you have added will be displayed here even you can search the patient from here right so this is the real time search right you can see this is the real time search right even this is the pagination enabled you can set the number of pages it's saying that there are five records right and if it's more than 10 records then pagination will auto enable right even you can sort the things you can sort by patient name you can edit it you can delete it all the operations you can perform from here right oh, sorry i think that is okay so this is the patient uh, record right so once you click on the test report so yeah this is the test report right and the test type report all of the test types so i, I already explained there are three type of tests so urine blood and stool you can see all of these things here this is a patient listing all of the patients with the image will be listed here and you can see the information here right the next one is a search report already explained you can search the report from here right so the last thing the patient test report so this is the all of the test which has been added by the admin right so there are two parts update result and view details once he clicks on the view details he will be able to get the bill right what the billing items was there right so once you click on the update results so i have added the rita devi right so once you click on the update details then you will get the bill number all things and the test code test name and the current result you can enter the current result here right so this is the range okay this is the range and this is the current report right you can add it from the test results right so you can add uh, any of the um, things here right this so once you click on the current results you will be able to fill out the results and once you click on the uh, save and print right so this is the mobile number of the Rita Devi I will show you later right once you click on the save and print this all result will be saved right so you can see all result has been saved right even you can print it also right so you can print it also now in the next time if you visit that page and if you click on the update result you will be able to see that that the results that the data which you had i mean say added earlier is is available here right <coughs> now i'm going to search this on the front from the front end part right so i'm searching it once you click on search you can see this is the text results and once you click on the view result you will be able to see the results right so these all functionalities i have developed in this project laboratory management system and uh, it's uh, already explained to you this is the major php and mysql project right so if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos and the latest technologies Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.